So, take me through the songwriting process on this album. I just, I feel like sometimes like, all these like, rap stars and whatnot try to make these songs about things that like, we can't relate to. You yeah, know? Like, okay, yeah. Like, like, like relationships and struggles and stuff and I'm, I'm you know, I, I want to make a song that, that everyone can oh, relate to. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Like, like when you, like when you, like when you're too hot, you know? Yeah, no, yeah. Oh, yeah. Why am I so effing high? Why you so effing hot? How do you get inspired? How? So, Renegade, how do you get inspired for like an album? You know, you gotta write an album. What do you do? Uh, there's a lot of things I can do to sort of spark the creative process. Yep, okay. Process. Uh, mm -hmm. pr process. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. uh, one thing I really like to do is some light reading. Um, this is a, a book I've been working on for a few months now. Yeah, um, that's, a, that's a DVD case. There's words in it, mate. Oh, yeah, I guess you never thought of it that way. You know, it's not its not always cherries and pop in the studio. Um, put that... Oh. It is. Yeah, it can be rough. We have, you know, as a band, there are problems. You know, any band has problems. Well then, what is what, what have you, what are you doing? I gotta pick out a shirt. We've been in the stew for four hours. Is this what you've been doing? Yeah, it's important. I gotta look good if I'm gonna sing well. You already have a shirt on, mate. Being famous isn't really all that. What, what do you mean by that? It's got so many fans. Yeah, no, you know I know what, what you mean. mean. I, do you, I, do you, it's the electricity bill is all through the roof. Tell me about your time living in Manchester before the band, before before the band, before everything. Oh, I was I was born as a wee lad in Manchester, aka the Windy City. Yeah, no, yeah. Um, uh, later, I moved uh, for work. I was. Uh, what were you doing for work? I was a wee salesman. They okay. Were their wee. Tell me, you know, what did you do? What's up? A legend. Oh, I'm. Where did you grow up? Where were you born? Oh, I wasn't born. Oh. No. Okay. I've simply existed and always will. Um, yeah? Yeah. Okay, cool, yeah. cool. So, uh, you know, you guys have had um, what one might call success. Um, <laughs> I think everyone will call it that. Yeah, no, yeah, I like that. Um, so, how have you spent, you know, the money? You know, you, you splurge on anything? Well, uh... To be truthful, I'm not really a big spender. I'm not one for splurging on, oh, on, good on you. material things. Yeah. Uh, I do have a soft spot though for iPhone chargers. Yeah. I've got like six. Oh wow. And uh, I only have one iPhone, so the ratio is totally off. But um, I just I can't help myself. I see one in the store and I gotta have it. Hey mate, what you doing there? Yeah, you know. Um, we have a lot of downtime in the studio, so I've been toying with this idea. You know, I just I, I like to you know I like making people happy. That's why I'm in the music business. Um, and you know, I, I just I hate when I have to pick up my phone just to check the time. Mm. You know, I wish there was a way I could attach it to my body. Um, you know, attach a clock to my body somehow. Um, so I think I'm close. You know, I got a rubber band here. I got a clock. Um, you know, really trying to draw some inspiration um, from some of the great inventors of our time. You know, Leonardo DiCaprio. Michelangelo, um, the rest of the Ninja Turtles. Yep. Yeah, I always keep three on me. Oh. At all times. Any favorite colors? Um, sometimes it depends on my mood. I like to go with the basic black. Okay. Uh, this one's nice for when I'm feeling a little, you know, Bruno Mars, sixteen karat magic. Yeah. No, um, you you know if you gotta charge, but you gotta be somewhere. But you gotta and you gotta show up and show off. Exactly. Um. Yeah. I always keep a few on me. Oh. Just to, you know. Yeah, no, I know. You know, um, some bands, you know, have traditions. Um, I know uh, Nickelback likes to kidnap children. Um, sometimes we get pizza. Hello, then. Yeah, I'd like to order a, a medium pie, please. Pepperoni. So, I just heard they're out of pepperoni. 
Um, there's a few other joints around here, but you know, he's really broken up about it. How I feel. I miss you more than stars there are. I miss you more each year. <clears throat> yeah, so this is the studio. Um, it's lots of posters. Okay. I like to uh, keep posters of some of my favorite artists. Oh. So, uh, you know, if you know, I ever need some creative energy, sort yep. of just can look at the... Who's all on the wall? Who you got on the wall here? Oh, um... This is Morgan Freeman. Okay. Incredible mm -hmm. guitarist. Yes, yes. Um, this is R. Kelly. Yep. Oh, he's in a little bit of trouble, huh? That's why he says help. Oh, that's a cool bandana you got there. What are the notes on it? Oh, thanks, mate. It's uh, actually the notes to the first song I ever wrote. Oh, what song is that? Hard Girl. It's about my mum. Oh, just kidding. It's about my mate's mum. <laughs> Being a rock star is pretty much all cherries and pop. Okay. Uh, this is all the pop I had uh, last night. Wow. Yeah. You have a, you have a favorite pop? Uh yeah, I really love uh, MJ. Okay. King of pop. You know, so um, you know, being a rock star is pretty much all cherries and pop. You know, I, we sing and we, you know, we record this. It's, uh, you know, what's that on your wrist? What? You, you know, on your wrist. What do you have there? Oh, oh, uh, this is just my watch. You mean someone's done it? Being a rock star is not all cherries and pop. You know, being a rock star is pretty much all cherries to pop. What, what do you mean? You know, like the ratio. You know, it's a lot of sugar. Yeah, well, you guys, uh, you have a lot of art. Yeah, you know, um, this is actually uh, the, the Jackson 5. Uh, but there's six of them. Yeah, but one's invisible. Yeah, I was a bit of an academic in my age uh, before I became a rock star. Okay. This here actually is my uh, kindergarten class picture. This is me right here. Okay, cool. Yep. I uh, actually went fourth in state in kindergarten for oh. uh, secret handshakes. Oh, wow. You want to know the secret? Yeah. Well, can't tell.